What is going on guys, 2.0 here and in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys how to get a lot of strange coins in Destiny the Taken King. So I already posted a tutorial on how I farm strange coins before the Taken King was released and that video went over really well with you guys, I believe it is still my highest viewed video on my channel. However, since the Taken King has launched, some of the older methods of earning strange coins no longer work and there are a bunch of new ways in which you can earn them. So let's get right into the methods I use in order to get all of my strange coins. So the first one I have for you guys is to do the Prison of Elders. This is a method that has been around since the House of Wolves expansion pack, but is still a very good way of earning some quick and easy strange coins. I feel as though since the Taken King has released, Prison of Elders has fallen off a lot of people's radars and nobody seems to remember how easy it was to get a bunch of strange coins from it. So if you run the level 28 Prison of Elders back to back, every time you finish it, which should only take around about 15 minutes, you enter the loot room where you have access to three chests. Each of these chests has a very good chance of giving you some strange coins. So if you put the time into this, you really do see the coins start to mount up. Another way I earn a large amount of my strange coins is by opening packages from vendors. Every time you level up any of the vendors in the tower, they will give you a package. This package will always reward you with four strange coins as well as some additional items. So every time you level up your faction ranks, Crucible, Vanguard, Gunsmith and even the Cryptarch, you will be guaranteed to get four strange coins from that package. Now, speaking of the Cryptarch, here is a method that has been around since day one of Destiny and is still one of the main ways in which I get a lot of my strange coins and that is to open a bunch of engrams. Every time you open a blue engram, you have a good chance to get some strange coins. So start farming for those engrams and you can bag yourself a lot of strange coins from them. And also, like I said before, if you do get enough engrams to level up your Cryptarch, you will get another four strange coins from opening the package he rewards you with. Another great way to get quite a few strange coins that can be done every day is to do your daily Vanguard and Crucible bounties. Once you complete the bounties, you can turn them in and you have a good chance at getting some strange coins out of them, along with the experience you will gain from completing them as well. Next is a method that isn't guaranteed to give you strange coins, however if you are rewarded with them, you will tend to get a very nice amount of them, and that is to do the Nightfalls. If your main reward from the Nightfall is strange coins, you will tend to get a lot of them, I have seen as much as 20 be rewarded from the Nightfall, but you may even be able to get more. However, like I said, there is no guarantee to get any, but Nightfalls are worth doing every week anyway. There is also a chance you can be rewarded with a couple of strange coins as well as your main reward from the Nightfall. So when you factor that in, Nightfalls are a good way of getting more strange coins. There is just no guarantee of it. And lastly, you can be rewarded with strange coins from completing strikes and crucible matches. So if you're someone who likes to play back-to-back -back strikes or play a lot of crucible, your end of match rewards do have a chance of granting you some strange coins. So if you feel like playing either of these, you will be earning some strange coins whilst doing so. So I hope this helps you guys out and lets you know how I managed to get so many strange coins. I know a lot of you guys have been leaving comments on my videos asking me how I get them. But that is going to bring us to the end of this video. If you did enjoy it or you learned something new, please leave a like as it really does help me out. Subscribe if you're new around here as I do upload daily Destiny videos. And as always, thanks for watching and I will see you guys on the next one.